getting answers from all across Northern California. This is the CBS 13 News at 10. We don't want that type of stuff going on in our neighborhood. You know, I think this is the wrong neighborhood to be doing that in. An alleged sex club in Del Paso Heights is feeling heat from neighbors tonight, but the company says it's not a sex club, but in fact a spiritual center. We're talking about Poly Urban Studios. The club is located on the corner of Boxwood Street and Del Paso Boulevard. And as you can imagine, those living near the controversial club aren't happy. New tonight, CBS 13's Macy Jenkins has more from Del Paso Heights. Poly Urban Studios calls itself an adult motivational and life skills center, but others in the neighborhood say it's a sex club that needs to get out of this community. Just off the corner of Del Paso Boulevard and Boxwood Street, a building wrapped in sheet metal with a sign saying they're open. Hello. So CBS 13 paid Hi, Poly Urban Studios a visit. My name is Macy Jenkins. I'm a reporter with CBS 13, okay. and I'm just investigating a couple of complaints about this location, this okay. establishment. On the walls, these certificates, credentials of ministry, and a letter from the Universal Life Church. However, the activities that are purportedly taking place there are... Um, that of a more of a sexual club, a sex club or a swingers club. We asked the woman at the front desk to clarify. There might be some things that you might want to say about that. I wouldn't want to say anything. I would want to leave it to the manager or the owner. On their website, it says, quote, it is our goal to help free people from that fear that others have given them regarding the spiritual blessing of the body in ecstasy. And the company is always looking for like-minded people who are honest, safe, who want and enjoy like-minded company. We don't want that type of stuff going on in our neighborhood. You know, I think this is the wrong neighborhood to be doing that in. And council member Alan Warren says he's heard similar complaints over the last few weeks. It's not something that I see that's going to be permitted in the city of Sacramento. Have you ever been there? Are you affiliated with it? No. All right. No one entering or leaving the building would answer our questions. Can we ask you a question? No. Warren says after investigating, it looks like Poly Urban Studios didn't check in with the city. Did they apply for any permits at all? Not that we're aware of. So now he's working closely with police and other activists to push this club out of his district. The property owner potentially could be fined as well for actually knowingly leasing to an organization that's doing illegal activities. We never got a call from any managers here at Poly Urban Studios, but after our second visit, security asked us to leave the property.